welcome back. Now, remember high school English? We all had to read or try and understand Shakespeare. I remember Romeo and Juliet. Admittedly, a hard read, but as a play, much more compelling. Hey, may I have this dance? Sure. And the lights come up. We all know it, Shakespeare's oh, most nice. famous play, Romeo and Juliet. It's the latest upcoming theater production being put on by UFV. Give me my Romeo! This classic tale has been tweaked slightly by director Paul Jeleno to help give the play a much harder edge. I really wanted to find a way to tell the story that was going to be exciting for uh, a younger uh, community. Is I've edited the, the story down to present it in, in a way that our contemporary audiences are used to. Just being in this environment that he's created for us really, really allows, or really, really pushes me to, to make everything seem much more intense and, and important, so. It, it's cool, it's bringing a new energy to a piece that's been around for a very long time. And even with all these modern modifications, it's still Shakespeare. Yeah, it's just, it's a lot more poetic um, and things flow and it's actually, it, for me, it's easier to uh, memorize. It's finding the emotional journey for Juliet um, and making sure, especially in the second half when everything kind of gets more violent. There's a lot of fight choreography in it. Because um, it is Romeo and Juliet, and I've never really done any fight choreography. The fighting is is considerably different from what you'd expect. Like, um, there's a lot of groundwork, so you're rolling on the ground, and and uh, you know bruises happen. I think that that the play is really true to how teenagers fall in love. Um, that that real sense of desperation and, and clinging on to that person that you've fallen in love with. And that's perhaps why Romeo and Juliet is such a timeless play. It's that no matter what the setting, there's that connection to the characters. A connection these actors are so eloquently conveying. I'm most excited about allowing the students and the university community to have fun with this play uh, and to, to get excited about maybe a, a, a different uh, way of approaching Shakespeare and the text um, and the story itself. The play runs from March 5th to 23rd at the UFV Theatre. With Go Fraser Valley, I'm Jonathan Horst. Well, that does it for this week's episode of Go Fraser Valley. Uh, if you want to take part in the hot button question and answers, we'll be posting them on our Twitter and Facebook profiles. As for story ideas, you can send them to go underscore Fraser Valley at .ca. As for me, it's time to run back. Literally, yeah. <laughs>